Welcome to Beerstyle from Beerstyle Brewhouse. Um, this video is about how to use the iTab. This is an iTab 2, but that doesn't really matter. Um, make sure your bottles are clean and uh, disinfected. And also just disinfect your iTab with a star sign or something like that. Yeah, and then you're good to go. So the iTab has uh, four functions. CO2 pressure, release, the lock for the bottle and the handle up here. When I put in the bottle, I'll pressurize the bottle. So now I have the same pressure in the bottle as in the keg. Um, and now when I open the handle, nothing really happens. But when I release up here, it slowly fills up. The slower you do this, the better it is actually. And when it's near the top, I'll just close the handle and that's it. And then afterwards you can perch. You can also perch the bottle before. And that's it. As you can see, there's a little foam on the, on the head here. Yeah, and that's how the eye tab works. Is easy. Um, when you want to purge your bottle, you can purge it before you fill it and after or just one of the things. Um, if you want to be sure there's as little oxygen as possible, you should do both. And what you do is just push the CO2, CO2 button, open for the release, and then you are purging, fill the bottle. Um, if the foam is all the way up to the top, you shouldn't. Uh, it doesn't really matter if you perch, because um, there can't. In, there's not no oxygen going in the beer, but you can just perch it a little bit um, afterwards again, like that. Yeah, and then you're good to go. If you like the video, please click like and subscribe down below. Um, it will make me very, very happy. And you also get the newest video directly on your YouTube feed. Um, if you have any questions at all, write to me in the comments. In the description, you can also see how I assembled the iTap uh, and how I built this keyser. Um, yeah, so there's really nothing else to say than uh, happy brewing out there. Thank you.